Palestinian protests continue to grow across college campuses nationwide. And right now, there are students gathering on Johns Hopkins University campus as protesters demand their schools divest from Israel. WJZ on your corner from the university campus right now. Jessica Albert joins us live. And Jessica, what have you been seeing over the past hour or two? Well, Rick, this is a peaceful protest on the campus of Johns Hopkins University, and it's the second one that has happened here in about a week. I want to show you what we're seeing here, so I'm going to step out of the way. I'm told that the protesters will be staying out here until the university meets their demands. The event started off as a study strike. Students tell me that this is finals week at Johns Hopkins. Students have been gathering on the lawn here, mostly chanting, giving speeches, and making pro Palestinian signs. They're getting ready to start back up uh, with their speeches. But uh, they've been taking a dinner break right now. Now, this rally is put on by the Hopkins Justice Collective. It started around 4 p.m., and I would say there's about more than 100 people out here right now. Students who are here protesting in support of Israel declined to be interviewed on camera, but they told me off camera, like I said earlier, that they plan to camp out here until the university meets their list of demands, which includes divesting from Israeli military involvement. As you know, similar protests have been going on at college campuses all across the country over. Over the last few weeks. Some of them have turned violent. That is not the case here. This has been very peaceful. Students, like I said, have been making signs. They're uh, chanting, they're giving speeches, and um, they've also been making announcements to people saying that they want them to be safe out here and to stay peaceful. There are police here, there are faculty and staff from Johns Hopkins here as well. So um, that's what's been going on out here. But we've also been talking to a few Jewish students who showed up for this protest. They told me that they do not agree with what is going on here with this demonstration. You'll hear more from them coming up tonight on WJZ News at 11. Reporting live tonight in Baltimore, Jessica Albert for WJZ. Jessica, thank you.